Alright. Hello. This is happening. I'm doing it. This is... Rant Theory Revisits. Uh, I'm Adam. And this is Bubble Bubble. And I did mention that I might play this uh, on my Snow Brothers video. Um, because because they're both great games and uh, I wasn't able to commit to either one uh, as to being which one would, would be the one I would pick uh, gun to my head um, <sighs> I'm not going to decide right now I'm probably not going to decide at all but what I'm hanging about is that music you got those games, like, you know, for a lot of people it's Mario Brothers or um, Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, music that just makes you feel a certain thing when you play a game. And um, Bubble Bubble's music has that effect on me. Um, something about it. It's just real cool. Ah, it's like real innocent uh, sounding. It just it just makes me think of fun. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Um, but this game there, this this game. When we talk about, um, I was talking about in the last video about the scarcity of uh, Snow Brothers being able to find uh, the arcade anywhere to play, and whenever I found it anywhere, it was like, yep, that has to be something that I play right now. Um, didn't really have that problem with Snow Brothers. That was very easy to get a hold of. Um, extremely easy to get a hold of. It was, it was generally around most places. Um, let's see if we can get all these. Ah, dang it. Um, yeah, it wasn't, wasn't real hard to get a hold of it, um, to play. Um, but it didn't stop me wanting to play it any more. Like, I, with anything, it was, it was great. I actually probably got a little bit better at this than I got at most other, um, arcade games. Um, is that an ice cream I can get? Yeah, it is. I missed it. Um, so yeah, I was able to play this a lot more often and, and yeah, get a bit better at it and, and get a bit of an understanding for how the game worked and, and all that sort of stuff. Um, yeah, it's still really cool. Like I, this is, this is a game that I come back to, um, quite a bit, like nearly monthly. Like I'll, I'll come back and play this game. Um, just because it, it just makes me feel so damn happy. Um, it's got that feeling. It's got that... Um, you want to talk about nostalgia. You want to talk about that kind of thing where a game makes you feel a certain way. This game has that in, in spades. Like, it's it's hard to not feel a certain way about, about this game. I know it sounds real soppy and it sounds like I'm kind of being a pansy about it. But it is, it's, it's, it is that kind of game. I've got to do this. I've got to do this now. Dang it, dang it, I only got one. Do that one too. Oh, they're getting smart, they're getting tricky. Oh no! <laughs> Let's see if I can get this one. There we go. I took a little bit too long doing that one. Oh, give me them burgers. Um, yeah, it's just got. I just feel real good playing this game. I really do. There's not much to talk about. Is really when you're talking about like arcade puzzlers, there's sort of not much to not like. Ar arcade puzzles, arcade platformers is what I was meant to say. With that shoe though. Yeah, there's really not much to like. Not much to dislike. I'm so enamored by the game, I can't even talk properly. I've got some dope fucking power-ups already which doesn't hurt at all making this game just that little bit more fun um how old is this game i wish i knew i should have checked at the start i'll check the title screen i feel like 88 springs to mind 1988 i was eight years old when this game came out if that was the if that is the year which i'm pretty sure it is i've seen that title screen quite a bit 
Um, oops. Eight years old. I hate these whale things, though. These whale things suck. I'm not going to be able to do this. Normally, I'll do this and then jump down. It's not going to happen. These guys are way too angry. All right, this is this is going to be where I. Oh no! Tell you what! Tell you what! Tell you what! Oh, come on! Come on! Oh! Oh yes! Extend! So I don't have to worry about doing that level. That's great. Oh, I'm happy about that. That's that's made me genuinely stoked. Because yeah, extra life, and I get to skip the level, and I also get to um, keep my power ups, which I've I'm this. I mean, like I said, I played played a few games of this in my time. This is probably the best I've ever done. And I'm about to probably die because I've spoken too soon. Oh, oh my goodness. How have I not died yet? Sorry. Oh my. Oh no. Just need that added extra, added extra pressure there. Ugh. Hot dogs! Dagwood dogs, even better. Yeah, it's good. It's real good. I think the um, I think I think Bubble Bubbles does does a much better job of um, of not making you die. As in, like, letting you feel like you can actually do. Yeah, you can actually beat the game. Whereas um, Snow Brothers does a very good job of making you feel terrible and that you're not very good at the game. All right, all right, all right. Oh no. How do I get down there? Oh, here we go. Ugh. I should have probably... Oh, there comes the ghost. Very similar... Oh, hang on, there's the one left. Very similar um, thing to... Um, to... Um, oh, I can't even talk. Oh, it's a big peach! Oh, I'll tell you what. This is the run. I'm having the run of my life. Um, very similar thing to um, Snow Brothers, where um, you, you, know, you start to die. You start to die. You start to take too much time, and you will forego uh, safety. Oh, my stick not working. There we go. I really want that ring thing, though. I don't know what that ring thing is, but I want it. I lost it. That's okay. Um, you start to lose, um, yeah, you, you, yeah, the ghost comes after you is what I'm trying to say. I'm having so much fun with this game right now. I can't even talk. Come down, ghosty. Seriously. Oh, give me that. There we go. <laughs> Seriously. This is just ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I don't think I've ever had a run like this, ever. So I've got this like... Oh! <laughs> How did I not die? What is going on? I want that potion though. What is that potion? Nah, it was bound to happen sooner or later. I still want that potion though. Damn it. That's alright. That's okay. Um Yeah. I don't know. This is really good. This is really good. I think this is a boss. Is it? I can't remember. No, it's not. Just a Oh, you know, oh, man, you notice, there we go, this is level skip, you notice when you don't have them shoes anymore, 
It uh, crawls. Oh no, I should not that! Oh no, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I get the shoes. Ah, oh. seriously? Oh, oh, oh! Ah, dang it! That's all right. That's okay. Ah, oh, where is he? He's that movement is terrible. All right. Oh, I guess I'll get him down here. There we go. Okay. Wonderful. Plop. There we go. Bubble! That's the game! Yeah, I feel much less punished playing this game. Um, I mean, it doesn't take away my enjoyment for Snow Brothers at all. But this definitely feels a lot more kind of... I don't know, it just feels a bit more chilled out. POPCORN! <laughs> what? What are those flamey bubbles? Oh, what's that? What's that thing? Oh, it's a Pac-Man bubble! Come here. Yeah. Take that. That was good. Um, I don't know. I'm just gonna have a couple more, couple more rounds, and then I'm gonna turn this off because I just wanted to come back and play it. That's all I wanted to do. Have myself an enjoyment. Ooh, got him! Look at that! Hey, get out of bubble! Oh. Um, what I'd love to know, I mean, anyone that watches these videos, let me know what games kind of get you guys going. Like, what's, what are the ones that, you, ah! What are the ones that, that do this to you? Do this, what's happening to me, like, I'm unable to speak properly, and, that was stupid. Yeah, what games make you, genuinely nostalgic like you know don't just come at me with mario and and sonic and games like that like you know if i'm um, i know that they i know they're nostalgic games and i know they're games that have a very fond spot in uh, a spot in everyone's heart as far as you know the fondness and all that sort of thing but like something like i want to know something something i don't know you know what i mean like tell me something because i feel like this this and you know snow brothers and games like that they they are like you know a bit more kind of sp specific to certain people like not everyone is going to love this game not everyone's going to love mario not everyone's going to love sonic um you know they're not they're not they're not for everyone I'd, what i'd love to know is just what gets everyone else you know pumped so maybe i'll play it just so i can find out what it's like um, so yeah, send me a thing. Although, you know, jump on Twitter. I'm at Adam B Metal. Uh, leave a comment, even. That's a thing people do, right? Um, yeah, anything. And um, yeah, maybe I'll play it. That could be fun, actually. User suggestions. Oh, I'm going to pop that, that fire so hard. There we go. Come on. Come on. Come on, get in there. Did I die? Wasn't paying any attention. Look at this guy. He's so disappointed that he's in this bit. Cake! <laughs> Alright. Uh, this has got to be it. i, I got to turn this off now. Um, Thanks for sitting and bearing with me while I just have the time of my life um this has been Bubble Bubble um I'm definitely 
still not making a decision on which one I like better out of this and oh, this and um, Snow Brothers. I definitely laugh more in this one, as in like had more fun. Uh, no. Well, that's apt. Something, something, something. Definitely didn't have to continue as much on this. That's my first continue. I'm well, not continue, my my first death. Um. Yeah. I don't think that's a that's a um an accurate representation of what's a better game. What I laughed at, what I continued less on. But um. Yeah, both of them are just they're they're those games for me, you know. Um. And um, yeah. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Um, what your what your uh, proper nostalgic games are like? What really get you? Not in eighty six. Eighty six. I was six years old. I don't think I played it when I was six years old. I'll tell you that much. But um, yeah, thirty years ago. Huh. So this year would be like the thirtieth anniversary of Bubble Ball. That's amazing. Very cool. I wonder if they're going to do a thing for it. Maybe I'll just do a thing for it. I'll just have a party at home. Um, anyway, this is Rant Theory Visits. I'm Adam. Um, check out rantheory.com for more stuff. Um, more podcasts. Go, bleh, more podcasts. Podca- podcasts. <laughs> it's just like a silver bag that you hang off the coat, hang off a uh, clothesline and just open up and podcast comes out. Um, and they make you feel real sick. I need to get out of here. Um, more podcasts uh, coming and more videos and all that sort of stuff. So check it out and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.